Westbridge, Yate and Chris, Memorial Chase, three miles, five and up. And Martin Leiden, that's the top one, Pellowin. Again on his own in front of nine winners for the championship. Randall Gross, Ollie Wood, Leo Zoldi, Alex Cherry, Tunisia, Matt Cooper, Philly Eagle, Matt Cooper, Similar Word, Alex Cherry, and Ion Optimist, Ollie Wood, just a seven winners then. For the Chris Memorial. And they're running. Over three, just over three circuits of the track to run. Arian Optimist and Sandil Gross are going to decide which one's going to make the run in there. They pass the lollipop then. Then comes behind the age Philly Eagle now in third. A similar word has been restrained back towards the rear, I think. Downhill they go. Sandhill Gross. How are you not? How are you an optimist? They jumped that one. And Sandhill Gross has jumped it into the lead now. And he leads just ahead of Leo Zaldi and Pellerin. Behind these comes our optimist for the Eagle Tunisia. Similar word is to that marker. They're going to go right handed now as they do so. Sandhill Gross jumps it from stable mate. Now we're an optimist to jump well in second, but got pushed along on the flat just to take close orders and now being restrained so the jockey don't decide what to do without horse and it's been passed now by Pellerin and Leo Zaldi on the other side. Tucked in behind his back in fifth is Philly Eagle and the back pair are Tunisia and Simmel Word. They turn swing right handed now they start to head up this little incline and it's Sandil Gross by a couple of lengths of Pellerin in second. How are you an optimist is in third? They jump in this. Leo's already jumped into third. As how are an optimist made another mistake. Partially joined then by Philly Hegel on the inside of Philly Hegel is Tunisia. Held up for a late one is Simon Word. Jumping the fence in the straight. All jumped it safely. So two miles now left to run and Sandhill Gross has a couple of lengths lead from Pellerin in second. In third's Leo's holiday, then Philly Heel, Arian Optimist, Tunisia, similar word, and why I'm company. I'd like to congratulate David David Robson on yesterday's Grand National win. David's been a big supporter of the league and he always turns up at the festivals and he always gets some really big winners at the festivals too but it's nice to see him win the Grand National and then sorry that Kevin's horse at Southside fell he's only run a I hope Kevin comes back next year with a full stable he's been a stalwart of the league since I joined years back Sandil Gross jumps it. The Kaplan's clear. Leo's all day and Pellerin. Philly Eagle, Owen Optimist. Tunisian Simmel Word. They're jumping out. Oh, somebody's crashed. Well, two went. I don't know which one was worse. I think Pellerin lost its rider. I think Owen Optimist crashed into the ditch before the fence. Let's hope he, he's okay, the horse, and he's not there when he comes out next time. Uh, Sandra Goss has been left in the lead by four to five now from his second place, Philly Hegel. Yeah. And he says, leaves all the in similar word to need about marker. Well, that means with the fall of Pellerin, the only man who needs a money in the field means that Mark Cooper had two shots now at drawing level in the champions table again for the Hunters. They jump in the one who will be last next time round. But Sandy Gross is going well at the moment, but uh, Mr. Hinton sources on the jumps have been struggling to win, I think, apart from the, the bumper horse, baby baby. Sandy Gross still leads four to five. Will he get Derek and win on the fences today? Philly Eagle in second, leaves all the day, and similar word, two shots of Alex Cherry as well. 
Alex is only on six, only two, three behind the leader with three weeks to go. Sandil Grouse from Leo's Holiday in similar word, Phil Hegel now in four and now looks like Tunisia's tailed himself off. A pass in the five and it's Sandil Grouse leading by a length from his second place Philly Eagle coming in Leo's holiday and on the outside Seminole Word and these four are well clear now I can't even see so they jump the ditch as they jump it the leader is Philly Eagle by a battle length from second place Sandil Grouse being joined now by Leo's holiday in Seminole Word they're going to swing right down in the head up hill Tunisia still not in the pitch as Philly Eagle tries to kick through him. He's got two left to jump. He's about two lengths clear. Sandal Grouse is now dropping, looks to be dropping away now and being passed by Seminole Word and Leo's Holiday. The last cherry pair now after Philly Eagle, who's got four lengths clear, they're going to swing into the straight one more fence left to jump. And looking at it, it looks like Philly Eagle only has to jump it because there's such a short run in now and now he goes. He's got four lengths clear. Of Leo's Aldi and he's set quickly similar word up towards the line and Matt Cooper's going to draw level again with Matt leading on nine winners for the table and for the Hunters Championship and he wins well. So plus thing for second between the Irish Cherry Pear and back in fourth for Sandra Gross. It looks like Tunisia might be pulled up but the winner is Matt Cooper and Philly Eagle.